bursts through the paint. The paint hardens again and starts to chip away, which means I have to contact the I really don't like to contact the sewer or the landlord. Although, to tell you the truth, the worst thing they discover is that I have a cash, which is allowed for the lease. And that's not a terrible thing, so it's probably worth it to get them here to fix the paint job on the walls, especially if I move in the next six months, which is a plan. And I don't want to have to deduct money out of the two months' security they have. $2,200 of my money, thank you very much, to repair the walls, which were altered by no fault of mine, all of which I made when hanging things to the outside of the door, which I realize now is a rather stupid thing to do. But once the holes are there, I might as well use them, might I, because there's no undoing those kinds of holes, just like there's no undoing dental damage. And I can't stop being paranoid about my teeth, about the fact that I haven't seen a dentist in a while, and I haven't seen a good dentist in a while, and some of my molars hurt a little, and it makes me wonder if there are cavities and other problems in the teeth. But that paranoia still lingers, and I think that if I don't call the dentist, then there's nothing wrong with this wild paranoia.
Jeringo. 